Now let's talk about the color of the minerals. First of all, I'm going to talk about the exotic coloration of the minerals. When we're talking about exotic coloration of different minerals, that means that the color is caused by some kind of trace element which is present when this mineral is crystallizing from the liquids. So these are all, I, I'm going to put them all here. These are uh, exotically colored quartz uh, pieces. So this is the original when there is absolutely no color. That's the crystal clear quartz crystal from Arkansas. It's very famous. A lot of crystal healers using this quartz. But when this gets like a uh, smoky color, we call it smoky quartz. It's the exact same thing, but actually radiation is causing the smoky color, natural radiation. And then you got the purple, which is the amethyst. And then you got the pink, which is the rose quartz. They are exactly the same. The, the formula is also SiO2. So everything is the same. The crystalline structure is the same. The coloration is caused by some trace elements, which in the lab, and usually you can easily find it on the internet, uh, you will have a chart showing what trace element causing what kind of color. So here we hit, this is the rose quartz, which I know the rose quartz caused by manganese. And then you got the citrine right here, which is the yellow. And probably iron is causing this yellow in the citrine. So this is what we call exotic coloration.